And what's your name? Olivia Conrad. And Olivia, where do you live? I live in Sioux Falls on the east side. And what do you do for work? I am a cosmetologist. Awesome. You want to give yourself a plug? Um, oh, <laughs> you sure? <laughs> I work at Etch. <laughs> so you work at Etch in Sioux Falls? Yes. And you're a cos cosmetologist? Yes. And why did you come to Dakota Hypnosis? I've been a smoker for 23 years and I decided I was over it and I've tried to quit before and it was hell on wheels. It was hard and excruciating and this has been a blessing. So what are some of the um, things that you tried before? Um, I like prescription medications, willpower, which I've known wasn't always the easiest thing to do. Um, turned out to be allergic to the prescription medication, but stuck with it and quit for a year and a half anyways. But there was the mood swings, the gaining weight, um, ended up on antidepressants just to get through that time. Yeah, it was just spiraled horribly out of control. So I went back to smoking because it was easier. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like it was horrid. <laughs> So, um, how did you decide to come here? Um, I, I kind of always had it in the back of my head to try hypnosis. I had also, also thought maybe I would try acupuncture, but, um, after, um, talking with you, it just seemed like what I wanted to do. I wanted to unplug the part of my brain, like you said, and replug it back into where it should be plugged into, mm -hmm. which to me sounded most painless. Now, I remember in the consult, you were about to waver. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like you almost left here to think about uh -huh. it. Uh-huh, I did. So I let did. me ask you a question. Um, can you think your way out of a wet paper bag if it's on your head? No. No. No, I have to physically remove it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so how glad are you? Extremely. Extremely glad. Because it was like, what, two and a half, three weeks ago? Mm -hmm. that I was, you know, I, to even think how am I going to get through two hours without smoking? And then now it's like, I haven't smoked since Monday morning and it's Wednesday and I don't even think about it is I couldn't even imagine that two weeks ago. There's no way. And how many cravings have you had after your first session? None. None. And did you learn a really cool technique that had you had cravings, you would have felt comfortable using it? Yes. Instead of smoking? Yes. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And, do you feel like the things that you're learning or receiving here are things that you can use for other issues in your life? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Hypnosis CDs have become my best friend at night. <laughs> <laughs> what are some of the other kind of benefits or perks that you've noticed that maybe surprise you? or? Um, well, just A, the overall how I feel. And even it sounds a little strange, but like I'll catch myself looking at myself in the mirror and it's like, Okay, I don't know you, meaning me. It's like it looks like another person even though it's me, which is kind of, it's kind of creepy, but not in a good way. It's a good creep. Mm -hmm. But it's, I mean, it's amazing. <laughs> I love it. And, yeah, I just, it's going to be good. Let me explain what that is for you. Please. <laughs> um, your self-image has changed. Yeah. So you had a self-image of being a gritty, yucky smoker. Yeah. And that's why you wanted to become a non-smoker. Yeah. Now, you changed your self-image to being a non-smoker, a smoke-free person. And so, when you look in the mirror, you're seeing somebody different because you are different. Yeah, it's like a shinier person. Yes, and, it's, and it is a different person. And you'll notice, you, the, we talked about mm -hmm. that, years coming mm -hmm. off your face. So, that's gonna, why you're going to start looking different, too, mm -hmm. as that nicotine starts coming out. Mm -hmm. So, um, every time you do that... Mm -hmm. You notice that. Mm -hmm. I want you to be like, woohoo! Uh -huh. I am different. Yay! Mm -hmm. Have you already started doing that? Yeah. <laughs> good. Good. Because it's a good different. Yeah. It's yeah. It's different. an amazing, it's awesome different. It's like, it's like looking at the person I may have been had I never smoked, mm. is what it feels like. Mm. Which is kind of, I mean, it's just weird. And it's mm -hmm. weird that it's so new. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just so new. It's like a new little tiny baby, but it's really cool. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like you have the, the mental and emotional and even the physical tools like the hypnosis CDs to actually nurture that little baby? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Cool. Um, anything, has, has anybody that you work with or your family or friends, anybody else noticed anything about you or said anything? 
<laughs> the pe people that I work with and the people that I live with have been, because they saw me quit smoking prior to this, have been kind of walking on their own eggshells thinking that if they poke the bear, I'm going to roar at them. So they're kind of, right now they're kind of backing off and just kind of watching me. So they'll get it in a minute. Yeah. But yeah. It's going to, you know, most of them are just like, I've just been trying to leave you alone. It's like, why? I'm fine. Mm -hmm. So. So how much would you recommend this to other people? 199%. And what about the cost of the program? How do you feel like your investment is? Well, if I, stop, if I stop spending about $120 a month on cigarettes, hmm, priceless. I mean, it was so, and that's why I, when I, what you said, I was kind of wavering when I walked out there. It was like, if you don't write this check right now, you're probably not going to come back. And that's, I mean, it was just like, you just got to do it. You just got to do it. Mm -hmm. And that's just cigarettes. I know. That's not the extra deodorizers and insurance yeah. and all that stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And it was interesting last night, too, because I, I noticed that I am watching a little more TV because we don't smoke in my house, so it's outside. But I noticed that I have to just even go outside to breathe. Like, I miss just, you know, I used to go outside to smoke, but now I just want to go outside and sit in my little chair and breathe and then go back inside and I'm fine. It's the strangest thing ever. It's mm -hmm. just so cool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you're happy you came here? Happy, happy, happy. <laughs> Super duper happy. Anything else you want to add? Um... It's, well, it's an investment. This is an investment for life. And so if anyone is wavering like I was on the first meeting with you, it's just tell you, just write the check. Write the check and go for it because it's amazing. I've also had the best night's sleep of my life. <laughs> Great. Oh, and you mentioned something, actually. The uh, weight loss stuff. Yeah. That, I mean, so tell me about the when you've tried before and what's happened, and tell me what's happening now. Well, before I didn't have the tools to, um, I just didn't have the mental tools to know what to do. Like I consciously think about what I eat during the day now. I, my snacking went down, so it's like I've lost a couple, a few pounds enough that I'm happy. That and and that never happened before. My weight shot up the first time, and I'm a healthy eater. And like you said, you need to be somewhat. You have to be a healthy eater because you can't exchange crap with crap. And, um, you know, and I drink green tea all day. I did give up Diet Coke last year, which I never ever thought I would be able to do on my own. So I'm a green tea drinker. And um, so, yeah, quitting smoking and always being worried that I wasn't going to quit smoking because I didn't want to gain weight. Quitting smoking and then losing some weight is like, I don't understand it, but it's a win-win-win. <laughs> just, just love it. Love awesome. it, love it. Well, congratulations. Thanks. You did it. Well, I did it, but you did it. I just helped. You helped. <laughs> <laughs>